You are father and son in real life. You're father and son on the show. Uh, yeah. Dan, is, you, is, is your dad anything like his character on the show? I think there's elements that sort of bleed in. Of the in. real Eugene Levy. Yeah. Sure, I think particularly when it comes to, um, there's, you know, we t it, it, part of the show takes place in a cafe. Um, and my dad has very particular eating habits. Careful. Um, pr <laughs> <laughs> Things have to roll out a certain way if you're gonna be dining uh, with my dad, particularly at a restaurant. Is this true, um, Eugene? You're a little persnickety when, you, when you're ordering food? I have, I don't know whether it comes with age, whether you become just kind of a curmudgeon the older you get, but listen, you know, when, I, when I'm going out, apparently I'm an embarrassment at times to my family. No one said that. It just, <laughs> the whole experience has to roll out with the precision of a royal procession in order for it all to sort of work. You just want things cooked. <laughs> okay? That's Whatever, all. I'm sure you're getting things cooked. That doesn't sound like that's the problem, I, Eugene. No, I don't think that's the problem. I'm saying that when you're going out and paying a lot of money for food, you just want to make sure that you're getting what you order. Uh -huh. I mean, that, that's it. So I get, I mean, I, uh -huh. I get, I'm, I, I get sometimes I, I lose... Patience, in a yeah. way. Have I've only ever, lost it once. You lost your temper once? Uh -huh. what, what happened? I, well, it was a... I've erased it from my memory. It was such a scarring it, experience. It was a family dinner. It was a birthday uh, dinner for me. It was a big night. It was my... Uh, it was... When was it? Last, uh, last winter. Okay. So I was celebrating my 50th. <laughs> and... <laughs> uh -huh. It was a bit... Careful, Andy. Uh, <laughs> just it was... It was a big night for me. And anyway, the service was kind of slow. Slow, 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 slow. By the end of the night, now we're waiting for coffee and now it's 20 minutes and we're waiting for coffee and i see the waiter walking back and forth going to this table that table this table that table that table it's it now has 25 to, i just minutes. need to interject just to sort of color it a little bit when things go wrong in a restaurant with my dad tensions get quite high so you find yourself slowly sort of sliding under the table as the night goes on. That is right. so, oh, that is so not true because I'm, I'm, I'm just the, I'm the picture of civility when I'm, <laughs> when, when I'm at a table. But I did, I did flat. lose it. I did go up to the waiter at one point, made a beeline for the waiter and said simply, this is the worst service I've ever had in my life and you are the reason for it because you are the <laughs> server, okay? And I'm telling you... Yeah, picture of civility, just it, like you uh -huh. said. It, and it that's was really horrible, service. Eugene. And apparently, I was an embarrassment to the table well, when I got back. I mean, you're de you are dealing with a table full of Canadians, so the rest of us were just like, we're so sorry. It's so sorry, sorry, we're so sorry. Right. But we've, it was a passive-aggressive, we're so sorry. Absolutely. Now, I have a question for you. So, all we've learned so far is that you're very picky when you go to a restaurant and you constantly lose your temper. Now... <laughs> I didn't say that. I no, didn't say I'm, just, constantly I'm summing up what we've learned about no, that's, you. That's pretty close. Now let's move on. 